Ciao Juventini of the world, welcome back on the channel, my name is Giuseppe and this morning, Sunday 5th of July 2020, we will see the Italian and international papers to see what they are saying about our beloved Juventus and it's a great day, why? Because we won yesterday 4-1 versus Torino while Lazio in the evening a few hours later lost and not a small loss but a big one, 3-0 versus Milan in the Olimpico in Roma. So I'm sure we will find really big titles about Juventus. I'm sure about that, but only not only that. Let's check and start immediately with a big page, Corriero dello Sport, because they are titling in big E Fuga. Escape, it is a escape, so they are explaining Dybala, Quadrado e Ronaldo travolgono il toro Dybala, Quadrado e Ronaldo were actually a lot more stronger than Torino Milan passa all'Olimpico con Cialanoglu, il rigore di Ibra e Rebic Milan is uh, winning over Lazio with the goals of Cialanoglu, Ibra on a penalty and Rebic 3-0 eight games to play and it can already be decisive so that's what they are explaining and then they speak about the other teams so Ronaldo in big with a beautiful picture after his goal yesterday on a free kick and then we have Gazzetta dello Sport with on the left Ibrahimovic on the right Ronaldo again with his free kick Il Milan scatta Milan is going off and then on the right Ronaldo with La Juve Scappa, Juve Escape, again the same title, not Fuga but Escape, it's actually the same word, you can uh, use both uh, words but we understand the meaning because that's important, plus 7 over Lazio, that's it for Gazzetta dello Sport, at least on the front page and then we have Tutto Sport, the paper based in Torino and they show 4-1 because it was derby day and they were not that creative because they are using again the same image as Corriero dello Sport with Ronaldo again like this and then we see Dybala on the left and Sirigu unfortunately because he lost and he took four goals on the right senza pietà Juve no mercy so that's on the on the front pages we played really well yesterday and then we see an image yesterday found on the web with Cristiano Ronaldo from the back this time instead of only the number seven we see a plus seven and uh, it it's fine it's it's nice to see it's nice to see I woke up really well with that news I was actually sad sad and I will explain you why for one reason yesterday it was a big day not only because it was the first free kick on of Ronaldo and we will speak about that but yesterday we had the goat the goat of the goalkeepers because he played his 648 game in Serie A and we don't see the notice or that 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 news we don't see it on on the papers and that's for me something really sad at least in a small corner you know that i like to take the small corners and make them big so i want to do a shootout to gladiator dibala she's called z she's following the channel because yesterday she showed beautiful pictures we had the third shirt from Buffon uh, he was wearing actually the third shirt and on his left arm you see 648 actually 64 Buffon because the B and the 8 is the same and then the players were also having that so that's really nice a nice gesture from Juventus you can buy the shirt of Buffon online for 100 20 euro with all the patches and the sticker and so on and so on but thank you Z thank you to uh, actually do what the papers didn't and then we do um, the rest Ronaldo what did he say after his first free kick after two years he's saying that actually uh, il gol su punizione mi serviva io e Dybala stiamo bene Dybala and myself we are feeling good I needed that goal on free kick on set piece why because he gave him more confidence again he was mentally not 100% okay with that and then in the uh, after in the post game Sari was also speaking about that and he said that he was he thought that he was quite okay uh, with Ronaldo 
not scoring on free kicks but yesterday Ronaldo told him finalmente finally he scored so uh, it was something that was actually um, blocking Ronaldo mentally so let's see now how many crazy free kicks he will score Diario As is playing with the feelings of people who are reading I, I didn't see any rumor of that but yesterday out of nowhere they are showing pictures of Neymar and they are asking where will he fit better Neymar at PSG, Real Madrid, Juventus and Barcelona and then they have a small question mark uh, emoji so I'm asking myself why are you doing that what's the goal of it are they really related sport uh, news about the transfer of Neymar yes or no but uh, yeah, so I just wanted to show you that there were, yesterday I didn't do the news uh, papers but there was something I really wanted to tell you Messi duda el Barça tiembla uh, as is actually explaining that Messi is questioning himself and Barcelona start to be scared because we know that uh, he has one more year of contract left and it can be that he will not renew Pep Guardiola is saying that he's confident that Manchester City will be allowed to play the Champions League next year we know that they still have two years of ban that can be applied we will know better in the next two coming weeks or in the next 10 coming days so let's follow that up closely this is it for the news of the days guys i hope you enjoyed it don't forget share the channel with the english speaking uv community so they are up to date with all the news the news of the translated sport papers but also the mercato news we have funny things on the channel we have a new background for the people that doesn't know yesterday i gave in a video the first really beautiful sticker that Turin giants made so don't miss it because we still have two stickers to give away and we have the t-shirt also that we will extract in the beginning of the next week so from tomorrow we'll do an extraction ciao grazie forza juve